quickly, what's the first thing that kind of pops into your head when I say the words renewable energy? Scam. Dams, I guess, goes around stuff, okay. like windmills. You know, the idea that you can run the entire country on uh, windmills or solar panels, you know, they can, they're only going to get up to 15% penetration. There's a lot of stuff we can use from the restaurant industry. It would be all the fry roll we have to reuse, uh, all the food scrap we have, we can put that in the trash bags and send it out to some company that can use those. Uh, there's a lot of gas power in that. Upon hearing that you can actually collect gas from organic waste as a source of renewable energy, kind of what are your initial thoughts on that? Uh, I, uh, you can get, I mean, it's obvious that you can get some, you can get methane from landfills. Um, I don't know if it's such a resource that you could support the country off it, but I mean, it's worth doing if you got a big landfill. Like the, the landfills and stuff, mm -hmm. and I've seen, I've heard there's a lot of them around here and stuff, especially since like NASA is out here and like the military. So they've got a lot of them, they smell real bad, and I hear some of them are causing problems and stuff, like the smell and like gases building up and like land rising a bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, seems like a good thing to do something about it. Would it surprise you to know that part of Brevard County's uh, uh, energy grid is actually powered off of the Brevard County landfills and the landfill gas that's collected from it? Uh, no, it wouldn't surprise me at all. Uh, well, it seems like a good thing. I think just a lot of kitchen use is useful for that, for how much veggies we go through and anything else. So I think it'd be a good one, especially all that oil we do for fryer oil and stuff. I don't look at it as uh, something that will make a major dent uh, in the energy needs of the country. It's, um, it's a limited resource, it's a complicated resource, and I certainly wouldn't want any tax dollars to be invested in it. If you could uh, create a system that uses you know, your own food waste or even you know, your own personal waste as a way to create renewable energy, do you think that's something that you would personally be interested in investing in? Uh, no, unfortunately not. Well, I'm not sure what it takes to do it. Just because you don't really think about when you're at home, but when you're in the big restaurant industry with all the scraps, it kind of hits you a little bit harder, but when you're at home, you don't really think about it too much. I can say, like, I'd be willing to do it, but it's kind of hard to get individuals to do stuff. Like, even, like, recycling, I know, but I don't always do it. Not a lot of information to give out about it, so what do I bring it? What do I do with it? There's not a lot of places in my townhomes that have something I could just put that in the trash and they somebody scoops it up takes it away. Because I know in like Japan they have actual separate things for each thing to recycle. It's like everybody recycles. It's like everywhere and there's a way to collect it and stuff. Like I know here in a lot of places that you actually have recycling bins that you set out and they take it. But even then a lot of times they'll just throw it out because people don't put the right stuff in. So I guess it's just mostly just resources for like the county and good education for everybody to learn how to do it. Lack of uh, information and I think it's never really been said to people that don't think like I do when you're in the industry and do that. Normal people at home cook all day but nobody ever thinks, you know, hey maybe we put this in a bag, we bring it to a community area where everybody brings it down. I mean, there's a lot more to it, but unfortunately, not a lot of information given out to other people. Do you think the biggest hurdles right now are just kind of the accessibility of it yeah. and the current level of education that's out there? Yeah. If, if it may be money, then I would be interested in something like that, but uh, it can't take up all my time. My time is money. People need to be more aware and more of like that kind of style, of like restaurants. You know, it would help out tremendously because people need to eat and we need to keep cutting, I need to start working, and I need to keep money going, you know? There you go. So.